It's live from last week, episode 16. Let's go! Welcoming my fellow Jaywalkers to another episode of Live from Last Week. Hope last week has served you well. Today, honestly, I've been pretty exhausted after working four night shifts the past four nights. But I'm actually glad to say that now I have two days off to recover. So unfortunately today, I won't be doing too much. But before I went in for my night shift on Easter Monday yesterday, I went by this house, which always celebrates holidays with their decorations out in front of their home. And for those that want to check this place out for the next holiday, it's around the Victoria Park and Kingston Road area of Scarborough. I've also had it featured in some of my previous videos. But continuing on, I have a birthday greeting for Stano. Happy birthday, Stano. Remembering those times when we played house league soccer with the Curtis Blizzard? And remembering those times when we would hang out in elementary school and high school. Anyway, Stano, hope you and your family are staying safe and healthy out there and you have a great birthday. So at this time, just had a local school behind me with my new trusty helmet and my board that I got for myself for Christmas. And we're gonna try skateboarding for the first time in 2021. Now let's see how rusty I am. Any of these things are still as hard as I remembered. Just looks like I have to practice a little bit more. So after 10 minutes of skateboarding and finding out that I'm really out of shape, I decided to come back home. And I was pleasantly surprised by the fiance for getting me some pearl latte brown sugar bubble tea. But before I enjoy this, I just have one birthday greeting for Ryan. Happy birthday, Ryan. I remember when we were younger, I went up to Aurora where you guys were living and playing the board game 13 Dead End Drive for the first time as well as reuniting with you in Jamaica for Ray's wedding. Anyways, Ryan, I hope you're doing well, staying safe, and you have a great birthday. Now on to some bubble tea. One, two, three. Ah, cheers. Where are the bubbles? That's good. Just enjoying sunsets and bubble tea. So before I go in for my night shift tonight, I got some good news and some bad news. But we'll start off with the bad news because I actually have two pieces of bad news for you. Starting today, the government of Ontario has issued another stay-at-home order, which will last at least a month until the end of the first week of May. Which means less videos outside and more videos of me inside my condo. And the second piece of bad news is this. Unfortunately, again this year, the fiancé beat me at predicting the NCAA championship. So yeah, I really don't know when I'm gonna win, but there's always next year, so better luck to me next year. And now, on to some better news, which is actually a birthday greeting. So happy belated birthday to you, Royce! This is a guy who I met through FSAT back when we were in university, who's also an avid Raptors fan. And I'm remembering the times when we would party up in the clubs doing the Gung Gung style dance. I hope everything's going well with you, Royce, that you're staying safe and that you had a great birthday. So today is the first day after the stay at home orders were restarted and I've decided to take this negative and turn it into a positive. So in between night shifts, I decided to start this Insanity Max 30 workout, which I'll be doing over the next month while the stay at home order is going on. So let's see how it goes. So I did my first workout, tap out at six minutes and 20 seconds. If you're a beginner and trying this for the first time, it's gonna be very difficult. I honestly think that for this workout, you need some sort of base of cardio because the warm up itself is a workout. In this room right now, it's about 28.5 degrees Celsius. A room temperature like that, plus me being out of shape, only means I can do better for next time. So now it's off to work my second of my two night shifts. See you tomorrow.
I'm back at home, but all day today, as well as all night last night during night shift, I've been feeling sore all over my body, especially in my calves. The reason is me being out of shape, as well as doing the Insanity Max 30 workout yesterday for the first time in my life. But today, I gotta keep it up and do another scheduled workout in order to see results in the future. But before I continue and do my workout, I have a couple things to share with you guys. First of all, I have a birthday greeting to Katie. Happy birthday, Katie. This childhood friend of mine was one of the nicest people that I have ever met. I remember her being so friendly, outgoing, and always smiling wherever she was. And her being a beautiful person inside and out. Anyways, Katie, I hope you're staying safe out there and that you had a great birthday. And in case you guys didn't know, today is International Siblings Day. So I just wanted to wish this champ, my sister, a happy International Siblings Day. And in case you guys missed it earlier this evening, the Toronto Raptors scored a franchise high 87 points in the first half. And luckily, they held on for the win tonight. So before I go on to do my second workout of the Insanity Max 30 program, I just want to give a special shout out to my Tito and Tita who came by this morning and delivered this fan. So hopefully, even though it's 29.5 degrees Celsius in this room right now, I'll at least be a little bit more comfortable with working out inside this sauna tonight. So just before I enjoy my post-workout shake, we're gonna do a couple of birthday greetings. First, I wanted to wish a happy birthday to one of my white sick friends, Tracy. I remember that one time I went with you and Danica to Riverdale to do some tobogganing. And even though it was years ago, it still takes me back. Anyways, Tracy, I hope you're staying safe and I wish you a happy birthday. Next birthday greeting I have for Amanda. Happy birthday, Amanda. This high school friend of mine is one of the most caring and friendliest people that I have ever met. I hope your family is staying healthy at this time. Say hi to Jonas for me and I hope your little ones have spoiled you for your birthday. Next on the birthday list is Emily. Happy birthday, Emily. Wow, seeing you grow from your time performing as a sugar plum fairy, to our practices at dance together, to you now raising a young one of your own. Be sure to say hi to your family for me and I'm wishing you a happy birthday. Last but not least today, I have a birthday greeting for Adio. Happy birthday, Adio. A childhood friend that when I was younger, I always looked up to. Playing basketball with him in the DBA at Curtis High. Just want to say that I enjoy seeing your posts of jujitsu and you inspiring others to take up the martial art. I hope you're doing well, Adio, that you're staying safe and that you have a happy birthday. Woo! Just finished my Insanity Max 30 workout of the afternoon. This one right here. And what I notice is that each time I do the workouts, I'm doing better and better each and every single time. Which is good because it shows improvements in my cardio and my fitness. So lesson be known that if you stay consistent, you too will make progress. Which brings us to our next segment. It's time for the lesson of the week. I hope you guys learned something from this week's lesson and I hope that you take it with you to practice sometime in the future. Anyways, before I go and enjoy my post-workout shake, I just want to remind you guys to follow Jaywalker POV on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, and YouTube. And as always, be sure to like and share this video, subscribe to the channel, and hit that notifications bell to be notified when new videos from Jaywalker POV come out. And once again, I'd like to thank you guys for watching. Stay safe and healthy out there. And we'll see you next time on Live From Last Week.